to my channel. My name is Sneha and I have created a beginner's makeup series for all of you. So I have recorded these videos in one go but I will be releasing them in five parts so it is easy for you to learn and follow. So my first part will be all about prepping, priming and concealing. Part two will be about the foundation. Part three will be about contouring, highlighting and baking. Part four will be all about eyes. Part 5 will be about blush, highlight, lipstick and how to set your makeup. So if you would like to get this look, please keep watching. Thank you. So let's get started with part 1. In this part, we will be learning about prep, prime and conceal. So let's start with pulling our hair back first so that it does not come in our way. So I'm using a hairband to do this. So second thing is whether we want to do our makeup with our attire on or not. So if you are going to wear a very nice dress and you don't want to spoil it, then just wear a cloth around it. And if you know that your makeup will not come in between and you can wear your dress over it, then you can just do your makeup before and then wear your attire. Third thing is I would like to say like always carry a dry napkin with you and a wet wipe with you so that if there are any problems while doing your makeup, you can just fix them with these. So another thing I would like to say is like plan what you're going to wear and then pick your makeup products accordingly so it's easier for you to create your makeup looks when you're going to start your makeup. So let's get started with our moisturization. So for the moisturization I'm using this Clinique Moisture Surge. This is how it looks. I have dry skin so I'm using this cream but if you have any other skin type you can use your moisturizer according to your skin type and just rub it all over your face gently in round circular motions don't forget your eyes so we are done with the moisturization now now I'll be using a lip balm this is a lip balm from Milani. It's called Keep It Smooth Lux Lip Treatment. I'm just taking a small amount for my lips. And rub it all over. So this helps to keep our lips smooth. So now we have prepped my face, now we will be priming it. For this I am using the Maybelline Baby Skin Instant Pore Eraser Primer. This is how it looks. So we use a primer to either erase our pores or to just fill in the gaps on the face and for a smooth application of our base or foundation. So I am taking a small amount of this on my hand here. And I will just gently put it in dots all over my face. Take as you need. Try to cover all of your face with this. And then just try to massage it into your pores. So this feels nice and smooth on your skin and that helps to glide your foundation nicely. So now we have primed my face. Next we are going for the color corrector. This is from Revlon. It's called the Photo Ready Orange Corrector. So I will be using it under my eyes and if you have any other dark spots you can use this to cover them. You can use some of it on the lids as well. But not a very huge portion, just slight. 
and I'm using my beauty blender to blend this. I'm just dabbing it inside my skin using the smaller point and just go around it like this so this is how I have done with my color correction now hmm. so next we will be concealing my eyes for that I'm using the LA Girl Pro Conceal Concealer this is in the shade light tan So I'm just using with the squeeze tube under my eyes. And I will be applying some of this on my lids as well. Now let's blend this with our blender again. So again we are using the pointy edge and we are just pushing it inside lightly. Just go in round motions like this and similar way I'll finish the other eye also. Just to have a flawless base and not to have any creases on the face. I just use some concealer on the creases like the laugh line and the creases on the forehead. So I'll show you how I do that. So you just smile and you can see these laugh lines here. So just apply a little bit of concealer there. And then you blend it again. And to set the concealer, we are using a banana powder. This is from Wet n Wild. This is the contouring palette which also comes with the banana powder. So I'm using a small brush to do this. And I'm using this part. Just take some powder on this and dust off the extras. And then just fill in there where you have applied the concealer. Also conceal your eyes and powder them with this. So by powdering you will be concealing everything together and there will be no creases. Basically, we are locking everything together. Thank you for watching part 1. We are done with the concealing prep and prime. Next part, we will be seeing about the foundation. I'll see you there. Thank you.